I love portals. Fling me through them, shoot me at them any way you want. I love portals. I have loved portals since such a young age. Portal was, I think for so many people, a great introduction into gaming. Now, it wasn't my, my first video game. That right will be held to Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets on the original Xbox. But Portal was one of those games that really started to introduce me into like gaming and gaming communities as I got older. I've, I've genuinely loved Portal. Portal 2 was, I think, one of the, if not the only games that honestly made me cry in the end. And I'm not afraid to say that because I'm a real man and I'm in tune with my feelings. Anyway, moving on, Portal with RTX. Let's get into it. Yeah, I, I love Portal. I've played all the Portal. I've played Portal 1 and 2 fully at least two, three times. And I'm always looking out for community-made mods on Steam because I just love Portal. I love Portal so much. I'm so excited to see it with these really cool new graphics. Considering that Portal is one of those games that, like, even for 2007, I think it was when it first came out, was really high quality. Like, it, it was extremely high quality um, and ran Hello, and again, really well. to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center. We hope your brief detention in the relaxation vault has been a pleasant one. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Before we start, however, keep in mind that although fun and learning are the primary goals of all enrichment center activities, serious injuries may occur. For your own safety and the safety of others, please refrain from. Turn back. The portal will open in three, two, one. Oh. Let's head into it. It already looks really good, by the way. Oh wow. Bro, it looks like candy. I want to. I want to eat that, bro. Oh, oh man, that looks delicious. I know how to pick up an object. I've played Portal before. Excellent. Please proceed into the chamber lock after completing each test. First, however, note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material prevents a patient grip will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. For instance. Ooh. The Aperture Science Weighted Storage Cube. Fair enough. Alright, let's get into it. Puzzle time. Time to rack my brain. Please place the Weighted Storage Cube on the 1500 megawatt Aperture Science Heavy Duty Super Colliding Super Button. That's a lot of different words there, Gladys. Jesus. Go, go, go. Last thing you want to do is have to wait all that okay. stuff again. Please move quickly to the chamber lock, as the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. Okay. Fair enough. So yeah, I don't know what it is about, especially the second one. I love the second one. I think it's better than the first one by tenfold, but I still love the first one. Um, I, think, I also think that's an opinion a lot of people can agree on. It's just, it's it's the world building, it's the, the lore. No, no, not the, the lore, the, just the, the story behind it. You're doing as well. very well. Please be advised that a noticeable taste of blood is not part of any test protocol, but is an unintended side effect of the Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grip, which may, in semi-rare cases, emancipate dental fillings, crowns, tooth enamel, and teeth. Good to know. Thanks. Um... See, so yeah, a portal is... Oop, quick, 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 quick. Is just a goaded game. <gasps> the portal gun. Oh. Ah. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal, portal device. device. With it, you can create your own portals. These intradimensional gates have proven to be completely safe. The device, however, has not. Do not touch the operational end of the device. Do not look directly at the operational end of the device. Do not submerge the device in liquid, even partially. Most importantly, under no circumstances should move. Thanks for letting me know, Gladys. The chamber lock. Mind the gap. 
All right, time to get puzzling. Well done. Remember, the aperture science bring your daughter oh, no. to work day is the perfect time to have her tested. <laughs> have her tested. Oh boy. Ella, Ellen McLean? Is it Ellen McLean who voices Gladys? And also Steve Merchant is waiting in the second one. It's just Welcome to test so good. You're doing quite well. Oh. Yeah, I, I am. Like I said, Gladys, I've played this game like a billion times. Thank you. Are we taking that cube? Once again, excellent work. As part of a required test protocol, we will awesome. not monitor the next test chamber. You will be entirely on your own. Good luck. Yay! All right. Now I can talk without being interrupted. I hate talking through um stuff in games because I it's it's always good to hear and you can always talk later. Like the stuff in the game is playing now. Um. But man, look how good this looks. So good. It might look the best because it's all set to like my um, graphics and I'm running on a, I think it's uh, RTX 2070 Super, which for this is on the minimum specs. I think the 20 series is minimum. The optimal is obviously the 40 series, but the 30 series is also much better. But I think the 20 series is kind of like the, the, um, a section that's a bit like you know i don't know do i know do you know do, does any of us really know oh wait there should be another oh yeah there's, a, there's another cube there um i'm smart because i'm pretty sure there is a puzzle where it's like um you gotta shoot into the door whilst you As step on it. Of a required test protocol, our previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. Ah. Good job. As part of a required test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two, one. All right, cool. Let's go. I want to get science in time. It's it's uh, g it's big. Big wrinkle stinkle time. Time for the big brain stuff to come out. Oh, oh my god. <gasps> safety is one of Look at those reflections, baby. Ooh. Please be careful. There we go. You, subject name here, must be the pride of subject on down here. Bro, reflections. <laughs> but I like how this this whole this the entire commentary of this game for me and for anyone who's played it is probably just <gasps> look at those reflections, baby. Especially Jack said the guy he would he would be loving it. <laughs> Warning devices are required on all mobile equipment. However, alarms and flashing hazard lights have been found to agitate the high energy pellet and have therefore been oh, disabled for your safety. There we go. Good. Now use the aperture science unstationary scaffold to reach uh. the chamber lock. Oh man, I, I missed it, bruh. I missed it. So, okay. <laughs> For a second, I'm like, is it gonna come back, bro? I gotta, I gotta get on this thing. It's my train. And we're moving. What? <laughs> I thought I messed it up for a second. I would, would have been very mad. Loading, racking and loading. Please know that we chamber number eight. We're strolling. Any contact with the chamber floor will result in an unsatisfactory mark on your official testing record, oh. followed by death. Good luck. <laughs> followed, followed by death. Cool. Ah. Okay. So go. Okay. I think I. I've got it. I've got it. It goes through there. Let me shoot that bit. It comes back through. Oh, I don't know how I'm still alive. But nonetheless, whoop, I am. Oh, look at the fog on the water, bro. Like the, the vapors of it. Very impressive. Please note that any oh, of your answer danger is merely a device to enhance your testing experience. Gotcha. 
Aperture science. Also, stay um, still still alive, not staying alive. We're not the Bee Gees. <laughs> um, still alive. Such a good song. Aperture science. Bum, 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 bum. The enrichment center regrets to inform you that this next test is impossible. <gasps> Make no impossible. Gladys, I think you're lying. Fantastic. You remain resolute and resourceful in an atmosphere of extreme pessimism. Bro, so good. Had to wait for the elevator. I don't know. Remember when I, when I first beat that puzzle, I was legitimately like, How do you... What? Probably because I was so young when I first did it. But I, was, I remember, um... For Portal, the puzzles get really, really complex, which is, a, it's a, a little bit of a shame now because I kind of know all the puzzles and such. But I got through that tutorial, Hello, except for one puzzle. Huh. Man, I want the other one. I want the, I want the orange one, bro. Whee! Spectacular. You appear to understand how a portal affects forward momentum, or to be more precise, how it does not. Okay. Yahoo! Yeah! Momentum, a function of mass and velocity, is conserved between portals. In layman's terms, speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out. Okay. Take a second to appreciate this music. It's so somber. I love it. And it kind of also gives like the feeling of like, the fact that something somber is happening in this laboratory. Like there's a reason that um, it feels abandoned, especially later in the game. There's so much, there's so much ev everywhere in this game. It's just, it's world building. It's not necessarily Lore, as people describe it, but it's it's story. It's it's um it's world building. It it gives depth to a game that's already terrific. The enrichment center promises to always provide a safe testing environment. Oh, let's go, In Orange Portal soon. Environments. The enrichment center promises to always provide useful advice. For instance, the floor here will kill you. Try to avoid it. I don't think it's a floor. I think it's just like. Toxic goop. No! No! <laughs> Thank you. Um. Is it. Ooh. Ooh. Uh. Not sure where this is gonna end up. Oh, in the right place. Ooey pooey. I also like Portal 2 more because it's. As you play along, there is a bit more, like, sustenance to it. I guess with having Wheatley and Gladys, like, more constantly with you. Woo! So that it can now manufacture two linked portals at once. As part of an optional test protocol, we are pleased okay. to present an amusing fact. The device is now more valuable than the organs and combined incomes of everyone in. Subject one down here. Oh. Ha! Real, real knee slapper there, Gladys. Yahoo! It's now Mario, guys. What is it with Valve and just like releasing a banger game and then releasing a sequel to that banger game and then not releasing a third one? Actually, no, I don't really know much about Half-Life. I'm gonna be honest. So I, I actually probably should catch yeah, up with that series. Woohoo! Oh, uh, b button. Oh, it just stays there. Okay. Woohoo! Oh. Oh. There we go. Perfect. 
<laughs> POV God is just trying to have fun and she just like breaks down. What's next? What's next? Ooh. Oh, it's this one. This is one of my favorite puzzles. I don't know why. This next test could take a very, very long time. If you become lightheaded from thirst, feel free to pass out. An intubation associate will be dispatched to revive you with peptic cell and adrenaline. Oh, you gotta. Um. There we go. Get in. Thank you. Now start moving. I can jump down, grab this cube. Yeah. Oh, I almost died. Maybe I should just put it in the right way. Hey, so it's this one we got to shoot a portal through. As part of a previously mentioned required test protocol, we can no longer lie to you. When the testing is over, you will be missed. I thought you said no more lying, Gladys. We all know what happens after this. This game came out... Six, 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 sixteen years ago? All subjects intending to handle high-energy gamma leaking portal technology must be informed that they may be informed of applicable regulatory compliance issues. No further compliance information is required or will be provided, and you are an excellent test subject. Um, can we, uh, grab that companion cube? Skidoosh. Should I check it? Oh, I can't do the zoom. Is that over? Thing? It is. Perfect. Perfect placement. Oh, is the key? Yeah, this one also took me a while to get down because I was very confused with this this puzzle when when I first played the game. That is, it's so nice to go back and play games, especially in like a remastered way, because you can really go back and like reminisce. Very, very good. A complimentary victory lift has been activated in the main chamber. Speed run. We're gonna bunny hop. <laughs> All right, there you go. Take me away, Gladys. Take me away. The enrichment center is committed to the well-being of all participants. Cake and brief counseling will be available at the conclusion of the test. Woo. Thank you for helping us help you help us all. Jesus Christ, alright. Um, I love cake. Oh, wait. No. Wrong. Don't fizzle out. Yet. Please. Yes. Okay. See, there is part of me that's like, would it be a bit more entertaining if I were to actually mess up the puzzles, but I've already talked about how much I love Portal. I've played it so many times. I know these puzzles. I don't know. You just says like a, a long play tutorial. <laughs> or something. I don't know why. <laughs> You're such a fake fancy voice. Oh, that was close. That should do it, right? Yeah. Awesome. It's also just a lot of fun flinging yourself around. Like Spider-Man. I want pictures of Spider-Man. Uh, 
Um, oh, there we go. Quit. Um, where am I trying to get this to? Okay, this will take me up. Here went up. Ah, uh, that's gonna open up. Ah, oh, there's two. Wait, whoa, oh! The, the thing, the thing got me, this got me. <laughs> And then that portal was still placed. Or else my sister would probably call me the smartest dumbass around. Go, 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 Yes! You can donate one or all of your vital organs to the Aperture Science of the Steam Fund for Girls. It's true. Self-esteem? Yeah. Go girls, don't worry about your outsides. All your insides are absolutely disgusting, rancid, horrific. So don't, just, don't worry. I'm not talking about your physical insides, I'm talking about your personality. <laughs> Starting to get longer. Puzzles are getting more advanced. Mandatory scheduled maintenance. The appropriate chamber for this testing sequence is currently unavailable. It has been replaced. <gasps> oh, the turrets. Fire course designed for military androids. The Enrichment Center apologizes for the inconvenience and wishes you the best of luck. Hmm, yeah, alright. Who are you? See the turrets, just so iconic, bro. Alright, where's this going? There you go. Please put me down. There you go. There you go. You're welcome. Dude, the turrets just like became so iconic. Like they ended off Portal 2. Oh. It's the Ratman thing. Ratman? Was that his name? I can't remember. The cake is a lie. The most famous quote in gaming history. See the... This music, bro. So good. I don't know too much about, like, I think his name was... I don't know, I might, I'm probably just pulling that out of my ass. But this guy back here, I know there's like comic strips and stuff, which like give this guy a whole lore and outside. I don't know too much of it, but I would actually like to learn more about it because I think give it portals like the best world that could have really good lore. Best way to solve a puzzle is with brute force. Oh no, it doesn't do the um the extreme damage on the cubes. Does it? I don't know. Right. Be seeing you. I think you just like drop the cubes on them, but where's the fun in that? And I'll just grab you. There we go. No! Ah! Is it still like the blood on the walls? Because like, like, they got the bullet holes, but the original portal actually had blood on the walls. Just have to bring that with us. What a banger. Oh. Hey, 
Ready to go? Did he fall through? He did some. He did some. Oh my god, there's more of them. Surprise, motherfucker! Alright. Well Don't you dare. Android, no! My tunes! Android Hell is a real place where you will be sent at the first <laughs> sign of defiance. A Android Hell. Oh, that's that's priceless. The vital apparatus hand will deliver a weighted companion cube. 17. 3, 2, oh. 1. The companion cube. I'm not sure why there's like the aperture science cube and then the companion cube and why this, this has the love hearts. Cube will accompany you through the test chamber. Please take care of it. And also why like people fell in love with this so much. I don't know. I guess it is the first one that's used in more interesting ways. The like this is actually commonly produced by enrichment center testing our superstition, perceiving inanimate objects as alive and hallucinations. The Enrichment Center reminds you that the weighted companion cube will never threaten to stab you and, in fact, cannot speak. Oh, good to, good, good to know, bro. Good to know. Yeah, I never quite understood the attachment. Or why it was, I don't know. But it's very iconic in game history now. There we go. More secrets? Can I get inside? Ooh. Oh, I can. Ooh. Barcodes. I wonder if they do anything. Oh, he was like, oh, because he's gone insane. He loves the commanding cube. That's all he has. he has left. Oh, I got my, my companion cube, Bessie, over here. There we go. Yeah, the companion cube is definitely used in more interesting ways, because it's like you got to kind of hit it into... The enrichment there we go. reminds you that the weighted companion cube cannot speak. In the event that the weighted companion cube does speak, the enrichment center urges you to disregard its advice. Uh, okay, so we need another. Yeah. Another uh, throwy McDowie. Um, perfect. Perfect. Oh, let's head back up here. I guess also because this game definitely derives to deprive, right? Deprives us of any kind of interaction. So it's like GLaDOS, which is very cold. And then it's like. You did it. Uh, the no. weighted companion cube certainly brought you good luck. However, it cannot accompany you for the rest of the test and, unfortunately, must be euthanized. Yeah. Please escort your companion cube to the Aperture Science Emergency Intelligence Incinerator. You know what? Call me heartless, but I understand how all the pieces were made you to... You euthanized your faithful <laughs> companion cube more quickly than any test subject on record. Congratulations. <laughs> okay, I'm a psychopath. I understand how this, everything is built in this game to like, almost make you infatuated with the companion cube. And that's how it's designed. It never quite did it for me. I don't know. Never took away from the game either, but never, I never quite, I don't know. I was always very willing to get, <laughs> to get rid of it. Oh, I'll, I'll say that much. I'll, I'll leave, I'll leave that there and let the comments get very angry. <laughs> with with me not not being in love with a cube. Bunny hops to This one is nearing its conclusion. 
The enrichment center is required to remind you that you will be baked, and then there will be cake. Cake. Woo! Oh, ooh. Ooh. And then there will be cake. Yeah. Um. It was. It was this level. This is. This is the hardest level I found in the entirety of the original portal. Well, I guess this is technically the original portal, but you know what I mean. This is the one where I had to look up a tutorial for when I first played it. Which also is a bit annoying because it kind of ruins the experience. But if you like, I like what I did. I waited long enough until I got to a point where I couldn't remember the test chamber and I replayed it. And whatnot. Um. I don't know if that's what you meant to do, but that's what I did. I probably could have just chucked one on the floor, couldn't I? I couldn't actually. Um, I didn't go in the right direction. Right. Whoop! Oh, wait a minute. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. Okay, the point stands. I still can't remember this test chamber. At all. Are you still there? Oh. Yeah, there's like a lot of, a lot of turrets. Hey, let's look at the blood. Are you still there? Oh, yeah, that should actually. Yep. Get did it. Um. Hmm. Okay. Right. Um. This one's got a system to it. Let's. Let's go. Ah. Oh, okay. So I gotta. Um. Ah. Oh. Go. 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 Yes. Okay. Um. What did that do? That power- that? Okay, cool. Um, yeah, I did notice there's a platform down there, which is how I needed to beat this level the first time. I'm like, if only there was something I could jump off of to generate speed. I just didn't find that platform. Um, okay, um... What now? Oh, sh... Still turret. I didn't even notice that guy, bro. <laughs> Are you still there? Target lost. <gasps> wow. All right. Let's go. Keep the string going. Um, down here? Yes. Blue. There you go, see? You gotta launch yourself off. Oh, I need to open that back up. Well, we're over here now. <laughs> no, don't leave that me. I took I took a risk there. Oh my god. Trust, trust the process. All right. Yay. 
Yay! There's more to this test chamber? Oh, yeah. Oh! <gasps> Get ready for some fun. If you don't know Portal... Well, you actually probably should know where this is kind of going now because we've done a lot of flinging about. But if you haven't seen Portal, this stage is satisfying. that the next test requires exposure to uninsulated electrical parts that may be dangerous under certain conditions. For more information, please attend an Enrichment Center Electrical Safety Seminar. Thanks, Gladys. Good to know. Oh, that's such a fun level. Oh my god. Okay. Let's go! The, f the final test chamber. Oh, 